When newborn babies are born, they often, after a period of several days to weeks, develop excessive vomiting, which contains curdled milk and is brought out through the mouth. This phenomenon is called regurgitation. And regurgitation is because of the fact that there is a junction between the food pipe and the stomach. And this junction is called gastroesophageal junction. Generally, this is a weak junction, is incompetent as compared to older children or adults. And there are many other factors which result in incompetence of the G junction. This results in the phenomenon of regurgitation, maybe sometimes excessive vomiting. And the point to be taken and careful that if the child is not gaining the weight or there is excessive crying, there is irritability, that is the situation, or there is choking, that is the situation where you should get alarmed and you should seek the medical advice for that. Generally, this regurgitation settles over a period of 14 months to maybe 16 months child becomes absolutely normal. And also the fact that preterm, low birth weight babies are prone to much more of this problem, regurgitation as compared to term babies. So this is a usual problem that is uh, witnessed by the mothers. They are unnecessarily sometimes alarmed and they seek the medical attention for that. 